Welcome back to AM Northwest. Ask anyone where to find the best chowder on the Oregon coast, and chances are they'll say Moe's. And now there's a new location with some of the best views on the coast. Here to tell us more, we welcome back the general manager of Moe's Restaurants, Bob Skull. Good to have you with us. Thank you so much. All right, you got to tell us about this new location. The, the best featured location in Seaside, Oregon. We couldn't be happier to be able to get a hold of it. Right at the end of Broadway on the prom, we've been able to build out the bottom of the Shiloh. What used to be the Shiloh restaurant is now Moe's Restaurants. Oh, wow. And, uh, and we've changed it up a little bit. We got the opportunity to do a uh, heated and covered patio seating. So Oh, we, you're kidding me. That's I am great. Not, we are, we are going to be out there seating people out on the patio, uh, essentially on the sand, probably 200, 250 days out of the year, and it's going to be comfortable. So we're That's pretty excited. That's incredible, because you can't really sit out on the sand and not be bundled up all together, but you have heating units and all that, right? We do. We have a, a very high-quality heating unit system uh, right into the ceiling, and uh, with that, we get people to come out, and we've got our surfboard-style bench seating out on the patio. So we're, we're very, very exciting. The features that we were able to put into this new location in Seaside really, really really bring the experience over the top for everybody who comes in to enjoy some of that incredible food. And really you're enjoying a piece of Oregon history because Moe's Chowder is is historic. It is. It is iconic on the Oregon yeah. coast and that's what we like to say. I mean going as far back as 1946 when Mojave opened the first Moe's on, on the Newport Bay front and since then with Moe's popularity and the popularity of that clam chowder and the uh, incredible seafood we're serving, uh, we've been able to open as as many and now I believe we're up to nine locations. Um, eight locations of course on the Oregon coast and then right. as well as we're now in Concourse C at the Portland International and Airport. And that's a pretty popular one isn't it? It is yeah. as a matter of fact we're, we, we love it and yeah. uh, and the people at the airport love it as well. It's really neat too because we have a lot of a lot of Portland fans that love their clam chowder and sometimes when they don't get a chance to get out to the coast right. they'll give us a call and say well could you run it out past security and we'll say <laughs> all right we've got you we've got you and we'll get it out to them. <laughs> That's but, uh, so great. Uh -huh. So, what, I mean, Moses known for the clam chowder, but tell mm -hmm. me more about what Moses known for. Oh wow! And yes, it was the clam chowder, incredible garlic cheese bread, and oyster stew, and made from scratch Marionberry cobbler, and peanut butter pie, and all these things that have been staples for so so many decades. But and as years go on, we've also oh gosh, created some other good. favorites, like the uh, Buya base, which is a, one of the most incredible seafood stews, and and fantastic fish tacos with a garlic cilantro dressing, Ooh. and uh, of course the the staples, the clam chowder in the bread bowl, and the halibut fish and chips are always the most popular on the menu. And don't yeah. you have a food cart as well? The food truck, yes, we do. We we have we now just the past couple of years we got a food truck and our. Food truck is a special event food truck. Okay. So it, I'll tell you, if anyone is interested in having that Moe's food truck come to your location for an event, you just give us a call and we can uh, we can set you up. And then Moe's won the 2018 Oregon Restaurant Good Neighbor Award. Tell me why. Very, very exciting. We, we're, we are super honored. Um, we were nominated because of what we do as far as giving back to our local communities. And uh, over the past... Well, over the past decade, Moe's has given back to our local communities well over $600,000. Wow. And through programs like donations to the CASA Court Appointed Special Advocates Program, the Love Backpack program. program, you know, so children can take food home over the weekend when they might not otherwise have it. We just recently donated um, security shades for uh, the Lincoln City School District to make sure that they have you know what is in hard times you know shooter safety assistance to where they're able to lock down their classrooms more easily programs like that and donations like that that we get an opportunity to give back what well, was because of those things that we got nominated and won the uh, good neighbor award That's for the fantastic. state of oregon i yeah, can't wait exciting. to visit the new location oh, i can't wait for you to be I, oh out there oh my gosh we yeah. tell folks if you'd like to find out more we'll put all the information for you but be sure to check out their new location on 30 north prom in seaside 503-717-5757 of course we'll put that on k2.com for you for more information bob thank you so much thank you Appreciate so much it. for having me all right